हेलो स्टूडेंट्स एंड वेलकम बैक टू बैंक एग्जाम स्टडी डॉट कॉम तो ग्लोबल डेमोक्रेसी इंडेक्स 2019 नाइनटीन हैज़ बिन रिलीज माई नेम इज़ रमनदीप सिंह एंड आई विल बी टेकिंग जस्ट फाइव मिनट्स टू एक्सप्लेन दिस इंडेक्स राइट सो ग्लोबल डेमोक्रेसी इंडेक्स द वेरी फर्स्ट एंड द मोस्ट इम्पॉर्टेंट क्वेश्चन हु रिलीज हु रिलीज द ग्लोबल डेमोक्रेसी इंडेक्स दैट इज द इकोनॉमिस्ट इंटेलिजेंस यूनिट राइट ई आई यू ई आई यू द सेम द इकोनॉमिस्ट मैगजीन फ्रॉम दैम uh they also release the uh, big mac index right that compares the purchasing power parity of various countries okay so uh come to the point the global democracy index is released by the economist intelligence unit that's the first important question very important you can note it down then the index ranks 167 countries on 60 indicators so that's also important so global democracy index 167 countries are ranked uh, and uh, ranked by economist intelligence unit on 60 indicators across five broad categories these broad categories are functioning of government electoral process and pluralism political participation civil liberties and democratic political culture on these uh, factors on these categories uh the countries are ranked functioning of government how the government is working electoral process is it transparent and fair political participation the particip uh, participation of uh, all the genders participation of weaker communities and all civil liberties the liberty of media is uh, is part of it and democratic uh, political culture the political culture of the country so that's important so on the base on the basis of these 60 indica indicators the countries are classified into full democracies okay obviously the full democracy is better than authoritarian full democracy uh, this this is really important students please uh, note it down okay and okay now it's working so according to uh, this index the countries are uh, categorized into four different regimes full democracies flawed democracies hybrid regimes and authoritarian so india is a flawed democracy because the the press is not free the media is not free the political uh, there are problem in the uh, political culture so that's why the india is a flawed democracy uh, the scoring is given from uh, 0 to 10 india score is i think 7 point something all the times so india is a flawed democracy australia uh, norway sweden new zealand these are all full democracies in asia asia pacific region australia and new zealand are the only full democracies right so only 4.5% of world's population lives in a full democracy okay 42 countries have experienced a decline in their index score um, while 48 countries have improved their score okay norway is at the top followed by iceland and sweden okay i'll share with you the top 10 countries that's really important the number one country that's an also an important question in the previous slide the eiu 167 countries the categories and the uh, you know categories of that uh, democracies flawed uh, full hybrid authoritarian these are important so norway is a number one country top uh, country so uh, the eight countries really important democratic republic of congo nepal algeria timor ethiopia north korea laos sri lanka in all these countries the word democratic is there but they are not titled as fully democratic so no north korea has been placed at 167th rank the lowest rank so the top countries the number one is norway then iceland sweden new zealand denmark canada ireland finland australia and then switzerland okay uh india's rank is 41st uh, 41 rank uh, india's rank is 41 with a score of 7.23 mujhe yaad nahi aa raha tha but that's the correct rank 7.23 and india is termed as a flawed democracy uh since 2006 it has been uh, you know marked as a flawed democracy a flawed democracy is a country where elections are fair and free other than this the basic civil liberties are also honored in such countries but these countries have some issues like media freedom in india the media is not really free it is owned by the big businesses 
who are influenced by the political parties and the media houses i they are running the political agendas of either com, either you know uh, political part political parties there you might be aware about it i mean on the social platform i cannot uh, take the names but there are certain uh, news channels and certain newspapers and certain media houses who are actually uh, you know um, supporting a particular uh, political party and another one is uh, they are supporting a particular uh, political party matlab that's what they are doing as of the moment jo reh jate hain i mean the rest of the people they don't have money so they end up you know closing their doors so that's what is happening in india चलो एनीवे इंडिया हैज परफॉर्म वर्स्ट इन द पॉलिटिकल कल्चर आउट ऑफ ऑल द फाइव पैरामीटर्स सो द क्विक फैक्ट्स ई आई आई हैव ऑलरेडी टोल्ड यू द ई आई यू इज अ रिसर्च एंड एनालिसिस डिवीजन ऑफ अ ब्रिटिश मल्टीनेशनल मीडिया कंपनी द इकोनॉमिस्ट ग्रुप इट्स हेडक्वार्टर इज इन लंडन यूके एंड देन ई आई यू इज अ वर्ल्ड लीडर इन ग्लोबल बिजनेस इंटेलिजेंस एंड प्रोड्यूस हाई क्वालिटी रिसर्च एंड डेटा एंड इट वॉज फर्स्ट रिलीज दिस डेटा वॉज फर्स्ट रिलीज इन टू थाउजेंड सिक्स रियली इंपॉर्टेंट सो दैट्स ऑल फॉर टूडे स्टूडेंट्स सो दिस इज द लिस्ट ऑफ अर स्टूडेंट्स हू क्रैक द आर बी आई ग्रेड बी आई बी पी एस एस ओ मार्केटिंग से बी ग्रेड ए नाबार्ड ग्रेड ए विजा बैंक क्रेडिट ऑफिसर बैंक ऑफ इंडिया क्रेडिट ऑफिसर इन ट्वेंटी एटीन एंड नाइनटीन सो वी हैव ऑलरेडी स्टार्टेड द आर बी आई ग्रेड बी ट्वेंटी नाइनटीन कॉर्स एंड वी हैव ऑल्सो स्टार्टेड द आई बी पी एस आर आर बी uh gbo scale 2 course uh, we have started scale 2 course scale 3 course and then for marketing as well for marketing and agriculture officer we have started our courses right so all the courses are available on bank exam today's mobile app or learn.bankexamstudy.com so 9067201000 that is the contact number where you can call even after you have purchased a course So we are providing the video classes, notes in the test series. You can access the course on your Android device or on your laptop or desktop. So that's all for today, students. In case there is any doubt, you can ask your doubts in the comment section. I'm going to reply all the comments. So thank you and have a very nice.